It is 8 a.m. in Liping Kwanta. Children are seen carrying water from the community's only functional borehole, meters away from the village. Our pipes are not working. We get tired, but we don't have any choice. George Afedo believes that his community, like many others, has been neglected. For him, the lack of parliamentary representation highlights the current challenges with accessing better school infrastructure and a clinic to provide health care. Honestly, we have been neglected by the government. So the past four years, there's no one representing us at the, at the parliament. So that alone affected the whole area. Because development is going back. Santro Kofi, Akpafu, Lolobi and Likpe have gone down the annals of Ghana's history for having no representation in the 8th parliament under the 4th Republic. For the indigents, that singular action has resulted in no development in their respective communities. We yet to see any benefits from our DC, our roads, schools, everything. Even the farmers don't understand what's going on. Like our roads, the schools, and a lot more. We need an MP. The lack of a social amenity like roads, they do not have a, a good road. Uh. Looking at the, the vast uh, area and the development that we needed, the DC alone cannot champion all the develop, developments in the area. Carved out of the Volta region, the Guan constituency, removed from the Hokwa constituency, became a part of the Oti region. An action some deemed unnecessary. Nana Kekrebisi, Obu Ekuma II, believes not many understand the significance of the separation from the Volta region. What were we gaining from Hohoe? When we were under Hohoe, we had only one assemblyman. But the, like the entire, uh, one, no, the, the entire one, every community had one representation, but now in our community we have two people voted for as assembly persons. He is not alone in his thoughts. Mike Usibo, an opinion leader frontal in the creation of the new region and now the NPP's candidate for the constituency believes nothing has been lost in the last four years. If we are crying over the, the last four years or the past four years, what is it going to bring to us? But the most important thing is that the ultimate that we wanted to have a constituency is in the offing and we will be represented. An assertion the NDC disagrees with. For the past eight good years, we have been denying the access to uh, the equal opportunity that we all need to benefit in this country. Even though a uh, district assembly was created, uh, the funds that are supposed to come as common fund for the development is nothing to write home about. Attempts to get responses from the district chief executive, however, on developmental challenges proved futile. For the many residents, they eagerly await December 7, when they can also vote for a member of parliament. Mawina Egbeta, TV3 News, the Guan constituency.